Okay, so I think we are almost done with this part of the galaxy. And now we are about to face off the boss of World 1. And I see the flag and that means it's going to be a big Bowser Jr.'s fire flotilla. That is going to be quite the feisty one if you ask me. Bowser Jr.'s Fire Swatilla, Global Gods A Kingdom. So, once again, Bowser Jr. gets to summon his uh, minions instead of him fighting himself. But, yeah, you know, we'll get to fight him one way or another. Now, well, Bowser Jr. is certainly becoming more and more like his father, making those ugly statues of him. Yeah, first, first Eggman created his own statues in the what you call it, in the Hang Castle and Mystic Mansion. Now, Bowser is going through what Dr. Eggman's going. But yeah, I really like this music here as well. Like, I did not like the, the first one, putting the music in the first one though, but I really enjoyed this one. Okay. Ooh, okay, and I don't know what to say about how, you know, they changed the Magic Koopa's gimmick in, into the, you know, now he's simply more to more than just, you know, shooting the fireball, but now he actually summons a minion. Check for the check for right. Oh, the bad one. Oh, that that one was the real one. Oh, good thing they they have the light show or extra show. Whatever, whatever. Let's make sure I actually have the point. Oh no, can I just say that this fireball, especially when in a 2D, they were pretty much a nightmare for me? Now you're there to make it 3D, now I can actually jump without it being that much of a problem. And there it is. Wahaha, <laughs> made it this far, huh? I won't need my dad's help to finish you off. I got a big surprise for you. You know what? You know what, dude? That's pretty much the what you said to me, yes, uh, in the last part, or is that prequel? And did you already forget forget about that? But then again, this is a well. But then again, this is, we're in a different game we're talking about. So, oh god, we got dinner's on. Don't forget to protect your belly ache, Bulger. Well, thanks for telling what what, what I what I have to do. Sometimes the villain is being too nice to tell me what player is supposed to do, right? Yep, Global God, this is, uh, this dude later on becomes the somewhat definition of the Mario Kart 8, Mario Kart 8, yep, I think it was Dragon Driftway. Yeah, I think this, this dude is actually more of the Eastern Dragon, not the Western Dragon. So, as the Bowser Jr. just said, you know, uh, what you're supposed to do is actually have to destroy that leaking, that uh, leaking belly of it. I know what happens to him as he has some kind of blister going on through over the temple for a while. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's pretty much what happens to him. You know, uh, yeah. Wow! So, he's going in a making village with his blister or whatever the temple for a while. But yeah, I, you know, I think it's best to actually go for the... Yeah, it's probably best for the going for the one that's gonna kill first than going for the you know. Oh. Yeah, I think I can I can exploit the like the like the like the early early part one, you know what I mean? I mean you can actually technically go for any order you want, but you just kinda want to do this uh, a little easy way and Oh. It's kind of hard to 
to actually, you, know, you, you get to pop all these, you know, all these blisters, even pimples too. Yes, yeah, sorry if I, yeah, yeah sorry if I, uh, yeah, for those of you who are listening to, listening while you're actually eating your dinner or whatever it, whatever it is, then yes, you might, you might not want to hear this, but yeah, 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 you know, blistering, blister is one thing, but yeah, pimple, if you squeeze it, yeah, that's actually pretty damn painful. I sort of did, but it was sort of unintentional, and yeah, sometimes it, that can actually burn, uh, burn from your inside of your nose, and when that popped out, oh my gosh. Yeah, sorry about talking about unsanitary things or in, like something that's not too clean, but oh, I can't help but stress it up, but anyway, backflip. My ears is actually starting to eat you. Someone talking about is, is someone talking to talking about me or something? I think it is. If it if someone was with bad mouthing me, then yes, I would have sneezed instead of, of my uh, instead of my ears being eat you all of a sudden. But anyway, a portal to the next world open up. Wow, look at that! You did it! You brought back a Grand Star! That's great! Now we can use the power of that Grand Star to travel to another world! Mm. We're one step closer to retrieving your special one, buddy! Mm. Through space and time to an unknown world we go! I'm jiggling just thinking about it! Ready, Captain? I was born ready, dude! This world is this world has the same music as the world one. Huh, that's quite some that's quite something. Wow, take a look at that. We found an entirely new world. Looks like there should be plenty of power stars here. Go ahead, we're all counting on you, Captain. Awesome. 